So, uh, last episode we spent over an hour on the Nexus, only to end up back in Kadara. Fantastic, fantastic. Let's, uh, let's get the heck out of here. Yeah, okay, that's right, we shot that lady. I was trying to, I couldn't remember exactly what we were doing right at this specific spot. Oh no, our, our thing's way up there. We have to run way up there. Son of a gun. Why did I, why did I leave it way up? Well, like, why did I not drive it? I don't, I don't, I really don't understand why I didn't drive to that place the last episode. What, what was I thinking, guys? There she is. <laughs> I think Ryder's wondering the same thing, like, why? Why did I get stuck? Soft landing. She might have survived. We know, we know she did, guys. We know she did. It's all good. She's dead now. On the road again. We're always on the road again. This starts getting old again. Cause we're always on the road again. Oh yeah. Yeah, I forgot about this guy. Should we just like leave him? I mean like, we've done, we've beaten two of these guys already. Do, do we take on another one? Or do we just say, you know what? You know what guys? I don't, I don't think it's required to like finish the game. So you know what we're going to do? We're just going to. See ya. <laughs> Best of luck to the colonist. Hope you don't kill them all. Welcome back to space. Dun dun dun. Go ahead. Do it. Is looking for you. Who? Wait, I thought you wanted to talk to me. Did you not want to talk to me? And who's looking for me? Court? The heck is Court? Scans of the Scourge. All that dark energy twisting and turning on itself. It's splendid. I suppose it is a rather darkly beautiful phenomenon. Darkly beautiful. I like that. Helios is incredible, isn't it? Not just constructs like the Scourge and the Remnant Vaults. Just all of it. So alien. A constant reminder of the divine intelligence behind all creation. Um, uh, sure. There's something about coming face to face with something wondrous that makes you want to believe. Wow. It's wonderful to meet someone who understands. I've had to justify myself so often. As if having faith in the divine invalidated my work as a scientist. As if this sacred could be diminished by the search for truth. <laughs> it's good to have different voices on my team. I like that. Excellent. Oh, speaking of the team, I should update the folks back in the Nexus with the latest reports. We'll talk no, later. Yeah, yeah, sure. Okay. Um, somebody else wanted to talk to me, I guess, but I had AVP outstanding. Uh, so much to do. Nope, let's just go to the next place. What was on the list? Kadara. No, get away from Kadara. I'm done with Kadara. No more Kadara. You are here. Okay, good. Um,. We got Aladdin, and we have oh, a new world over here as well. Like, well, yeah, let's. Uh, who are we settling way the heck out here? Well, I guess we already did because Void is right there. Void, 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 whatever. We got a science team here. Eos was was Eos the first place we settled? I feel like maybe I don't. I don't remember. I don't know. Okay, we're gonna go. This is a desert planet. I remember that. Uh, I don't really like this one. And then this is like a 
Yeah, that one's, I think, the funner one. If I'm not mistaken. Uh, we'll, 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 we'll deal with the... We'll, we'll just get this out of the way. <laughs> it's exciting content, right? It makes you really excited to watch this whenever the person playing is like, yeah, let's just get this out of the way. <laughs> This game does become very repetitive, and it's unfortunate. Alright, like, I don't even care about, like, exploring all of this. I just, I'm just, like, yeah. We're on course. I mean, that's, that's, that's one of the big things about Mass Effect, though, is that you do explore the space stuff, and you get normally good stuff for it, but, um... Oh, this is pretty cool, actually. So, like, two moon. This is a moon as well, I guess. Yeah, let's just start. Sam, send Callow the nav point provided by our Krogan contact. Drac, we're landing on Elodin to rendezvous with Jorgal Strux. On my way. Who? <laughs> Jorgus? Jorgus Strux? Okay. Cool. I don't think you're supposed to land upside down. Where is this meeting place exactly? Called the Paradise. Middle of nowhere, as far as I can tell. That's good. Paradise is different for a Krogan. And more remnant crap. Remnant starship? No. Only oh, forty one percent exposed. I will gather what information I can, Pathfinder. A starship? Okay. That's different, at least. I don't remember that. It's a pretty view. Alright, five minutes later we'll land, guys. <laughs> Who lives here besides the Krogan? Scavengers with nothing to lose. Criminals chucked out of Kadara. Gonna be interesting. Yeah, we need the Krogan though for the final battle, so we actually do need to uh, help these guys out. Taming a desert, activate... Laden's monoliths. We want to be careful. From what I hear, it's swarming with scum. Just make sure you know where your guns are. Well, we're all scum at the end of the day. None of us innocent. None of us are innocent. Oh, it's a heat hazard. Oh, crap. Okay, we gotta deal with that now. Done exploring, guys. I just want to shooty shoot. I just want to shooty shoot people in the face. If it isn't the Pathfinder. Yeah, worship me. What I wouldn't give for a little Hi guys, how's it going? Uh, let's, hey, let's go. Hey. Nope, don't care. I'm not doing a mission. Shut up. Go away. Activating automated forward station deployment. Good job. Good job. Alright, um. I think I need to talk to someone in here. Hi. It's a fair. So you're in here. That's right. And you are? Veteran X. We do business with the same people on Kadara. Ah, yes, one of the newcomers. Welcome, all of you, to my paradise. Outside the gates, you're on your own, but in here, you're safe. Anyone violates the peace, they have to answer to me. Being able to maintain control here must be difficult. These people need me. They need what I sell, so they behave, or they're out. Now, what can I get you? How can I help? Just let me know. I'm supposed to meet a Krogan here named Strux. Look around. If my customers have names, I don't know them. 
It's better that way. <laughs> okay. Well, goodbye. I'll look around. Huh. All right. Behind here? Yeah, it's gone. What's up? Step off. No. Nope. Not allowed back here. Ugh. Okay, fine. Fine. Ah, oh, here he is. Stop shushing me. Strux huh. should be leaving. Are you Jorgal Strux? Maybe. You who I think you are? Sarah Ryder, Pathfinder for the Initiative. You asked me to meet you here. Yeah, I did. Thanks for coming. Losing the Krogan was a big deal to a lot of us in the Initiative. Some of my best friends are Krogan. That's right. I didn't want to leave the Nexus, but I needed to support my people and my clan. So, trouble at the colony? It's heading to a bad place. We can't be there anymore. Morda's become a tyrant. Did she kick you out? It hasn't come to that yet, so we're laying low. I want to keep my eye on her. She's planning a strike against the Nexus, that much we know. The audio logs you sent do sound like something bad is brewing. Morda is going to rip this colony apart. And then we're all going to die. Krogan dying? Your homeworld's worse than this place. Everyone needs food and water, even Krogan. Morda's rationing. My group thinks the Krogan should make peace with the Nexus. We need the Krogan, and the Krogan need us. We all came to Andromeda as one. We should at least try to fix this. Well, there won't be a colony to make peace with if Morda ruins it. You don't believe me? Go to the Krogan colony yourself and see what she's planning. Talk to Ravenar Brink. He's one of us, on the inside. If the safety of the Nexus is really on the line, I'll go. Better hope she doesn't shoot me on sight. Yeah, that'd be a bad omen. Okay. All right, so I guess we're gonna go uh, meet this lady. Parlay with the Krogan. I'm pretty sure I can't get there until I. Let's see. It's pretty far out there. Okay, let's just activate these. We'll activate these because it's on the way. And then we need to move the triggers. Holy crap, some healing. Oh yeah, the Torian Arc as well. Oh, I forgot about the Torian Arc. We gotta figure that one out too. Okay, so there's quite a bit to do on this planet. <clears throat> Which is fine. You know, it's all good. So we'll uh we'll activate the monolith this episode hopefully we'll get that done we're gonna cut out a lot of it because it's all the same stuff that we've done before you know just driving and i detect above normal temperatures yes thank you oh gosh we're gonna get the temperature we're gonna get Wetterman sam again oh gosh not Wetterman sam so elodin charming so far what do we got besides the sand the remnant monolith suggests this was indeed supposed to be a golden world it also suggests the presence of a vault. Additionally, here is the large derelict remnant ship that we saw as we landed. Hopefully abandoned. Scans indicate it is not. The site is active with scavengers and remnant bots. Hmm. Here, scavengers have taken over an abandoned camp between the two. In this direction, located in one of the planet's sinkholes, is New Tachanka, the Krogan colony. Sinkholes. Sounds fun. Not really. Elodin is tidily locked to its sister moon and that gas giant above. This side of the moon never cools. Getting trapped in a sinkhole without shelter would mean certain death, as one's blood would boil in 75 seconds. Dang. And on that cheery note, let's head for the climate-controlled paradise of the Nomad. Yeah, let's do that. Temperature levels are climbing, Pathfinder. It's fine, it's fine. Am I going, am I going the right way? Nope, nope, <laughs> sure, sure not. So it's this one right here. Okay. Oh, this looks like a beautiful place to colonize. Wow. 
desert for days. What do we have here? I like her armor. Kill her. Yeah, yeah good luck with that. I'm not just completely ignoring you guys, because, you know, all I gotta do is drive past you. <laughs> Getting some air time there, holy crap. Okay. That's cool stuff to look at, at least, when you're... Hey, guys. What's going on? Oh, just knock that guy out. I'm reading a normal temperature range, Pathfinder. Oh, gosh. Sam, just please stop. Pathfinder, well, I detect a dip in temperature better. ahead. I advise the scavengers have set a deep exposure, out. Pathfinder. Gonna be hard to avoid out here. All right. Come on. Nobody to shooty shoot? No. Let me guess. I'm gonna have to find the thing in my jigs and all that good stuff. You'll need to scan for the missing glyphs, Pathfinder. Oh, we Wonder are. if I get anything on the scanner. Yeah, yep, yeah, you're gonna get way up there because why not? Okay. Alright. Stupid skinny skin. Okay, I'm guessing there's something else I have to activate. You don't want to be Resident Evil people over here. That'll help. Bullet. Bullet? Uh, I mean, uh, how? How's that helping? Well, that'll help. There we go. You should now be able to interface Pathfinder. Yeah, I bet you have to do a freaking Sudoku puzzle now too. What? Job. Okay. Going. Yeah. All right. Not too bad. Not too bad. No rage yet. No rage. Just a little slight uh, passive aggressiveness. I'm not a gamer, so that's good. All right. Two more to do. We we still have a chance for a little bit of rage, guys. We still have a chance for a little bit of rage. I detect a considerable temperature drop in shaded areas. Okay. So you just gotta stick to the shade. Yeah. Temperature levels are climbing, Pathfinder. Thank you, Weatherman Sam. Appreciate you, bro. Enemies! I don't care. I just wanna go to the road, go to the thing, to activate the thing so it's not so hot anymore, you know? And yeah, okay. What is going on there? Was that a speeder? Oh. Uh, Lander. Smoking pile of junk? Must be outlaws. Yeah, Environmental temperatures fine. are within acceptable limits. Let me guess it's hot again, Sam. Go ahead, tell me. The ambient Got temperature is normal. <laughs> we got them all, did we? We avoided them all. I detect above normal temperature. Well, so is this, this is where the worst of the worst gather. Elodin will never be a safe place to settle unless they're gone. So let's get them gone. Let's kill these guys. Sounds good. Because I want to do something other than just driving around activating vaults. Oh, wait. Wait, no. I... I... What? I can't get inside. Why did y'all tease me like that? Y'all teased me at that. Okay. Well, never mind. We're going to go back to activating the vault. I can't even do that yeah, yet. Yeah. Still hot. Okay, cool. We need to get out of this heat zone. Shut up. I detect above normal temperatures. Shut up, Sam. Environmental temperatures are within acceptable limits. I'm gonna deactivate you, dude. I'm so gonna deactivate you. Come on. No, no, no. Ah. It's right here. I gotta just climb this mountain. Dude, this mountain though, holy crap. There's a road that goes right around it. It's probably a road we should have took, I guess. Just scaling the side of a mountain, because why not? The physics of this don't make any sense today. Oh, dead. Let me up, just let me up, just let me up. Okay. Up, up, no, no, no. Okay, yep. Could you imagine, like, just driving up on the side of a mountain like this? Like, what the heck is, like... There it is. Alright, good, good, good. 
Just let me activate it. Be done. No, don't regurgitate content. Please, please, please. Guess we need more of those pictures. Son of a Wonder gun. Wonder if I get anything on the scanner. I bet you would. Way up there. Yep, yep, you sure would. Hate this game. Oh, I guess that's all I had to do. Just wanted me to press the console. Yeah. This game is really fascinated with its consoles. I mean, like, whatever. Okay. I'm not even. Nope. We're. It's it's fine. It's fine. I think I'm that's not, enough. Yeah, I bet. I bet it is. I bet it is. At least it's nice. not making me do the stupid Sudoku puzzles. I mean, I'm all about Sudoku puzzles, but I mean, it's like whatever. One more, guys. One more. We found the road. We see turn around. Yes. That's right. It's going towards the ship, though. I don't want to do that. That's the remnant derelict Morta's obsessed with. Huh. Well, we don't want to mess with this yet, though, right? Let's talk to Morta first. We don't even know. How do we even know that she's obsessed with it? Because we haven't even talked to her yet. I just want to get here. Like, I'm trying to go here. Like, you are here. That's what I wanted to say. <laughs> Okay, so we're gonna go across the desert side. Oh my gosh, dude. You know what would be cool? Like the devs are just going around smoking a joint or whatnot, you know? And they're like, hey, bro, you know what would be cool? Is if we make them constantly go five miles an hour, bro. And, like, not know where to go, Automated man. It's gonna be so cool. It'd be like they're exploring and stuff. But instead of exploring, they'll probably just be ragey, bro. It's gonna be so funny, dude. Mining zones have been added it's gonna be to such a fun game funding. to play. We won't have, we won't even have to put any story in it, bro. We'll just make it do like a bunch of stuff all over again. The same thing over and over, bro. It's gonna be so cool. We don't even have to work on those storylines or nothing, man. Bro, we won't even have to develop it at all. It's gonna be awesome. <laughs> I'm pretty sure that's how the, the, the uh, dev meetings went for this game. Something like that. I'm not gonna be able to climb this wall, am I? Like, that's exactly how these meetings went. See, this sometimes like why? I'm reading a normal temperature range. Good, finder. you're about to read a hot temperature range. Life support restored. What the heck was that? No. What is that? Can we not? Can we not? What was that? I just, just want to activate the vault, guys. Oh my god. Lots of space out here for the Krogan to expand. That's the hope, anyway. Yeah. Still. Need you against the cat, that's for sure. Okay, we're going towards the scary monster thing. That's, that's good. Good deal. Where'd he go? Keep driving, just keep driving. Don't get murdered. Cat knocked over a cop. Scared me, made me jump. All right. Let's find the glyphs. Looks like it isn't filled in yet. Well, at least I have one Sudoku puzzle to do. You should now be able to interface Pathfinder. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. All right, another Sudoku puzzle. Right. That did the job. Good going. Yep. Wait, what? Escape the purification. Oh, investigate the vault's entrance. It got a little ahead of itself there. Please tell me that this is one of those vaults that I just don't have to do anything to. I just, you know, go in there, activate the thingamajig, and we're good to go. I think we had one vault like that. Alright, let's go, let's go, let's go. Buried in the sand. Oh, that's that thing we passed earlier. That's that's what that was. Okay. Um. Oh. Okay. 
okay. Hi. All right. Well, uh, you know, uh, looking at the time, we're actually not even gonna have time to to finish this. Uh, this might end up being like a ten minute episode by the time I edit it down. But uh, yeah, we're uh, we spent a lot of time driving around and uh, talking to people and getting here, so that's good. Uh, I guess we'll figure out what we have to do in this vault next episode. Uh, hopefully, the vault doesn't take that long to complete, but we'll uh, we'll figure it out. We're on another planet, though. Yeah, yeah. At least there's a at least there's that to look at, though. That's pretty, right? I mean, that's that's good. Totally not getting annoyed at the game, guys. Totally not getting annoyed at the game. Remember, we love Mass Effect. I'll do a lot. I'll do love a Mass Effect. Maybe not the biggest fan of Andromeda. But definitely love Mass Effect. Alright. <laughs> Start tripping now, I'm blue. Mega man. I can't wait for losing because I got too many haters, man. Used to be the paper boy. Grew up now, I'm Mega man. Player one, player two. Show your players do. Up, down, left, right. Hit them with a strong attack. Yeah, I smoke the strongest pack. Tell me what is wrong with that. No coins in the laundry, man. You can't help but honor that. Jam, man, Mega man. Mogan's in the Sega, man.